Hello party people and welcome to another video. We've got lots of cleaning going on today. I am picking up the downstairs and the upstairs, just kind of the whole house doing like a house reset pickup. My husband had been out of town for a few days and the house was kind of, kind of messy. So we are getting our lives together <laughs> before dad gets home. So my kid, my daughter is helping me fold this laundry before she heads off to work. And we're gonna take this laundry, I did like four or five loads, head back upstairs, and then we are going to put it away. I'm gonna do a quick cleanup of my bathroom and bedroom, come back downstairs, do a quick cleanup of the rest of the house. So that's what we're doing today. I hope you guys are doing great. Thank you guys for taking the time to click on my video. I hope you enjoy hanging out with me. My name is Melissa, I have two children, Taylor and Tyler. Taylor is 17, she's graduating in, oh my gosh, holy guacamole you guys like six weeks it's crazy my little baby and then my son Tyler is 15 he's a freshman in high school and he's you know like into football and all that kind of stuff and we also have my or our yellow lab Charlie he's kind of like the baby of the family we just love Charlie he is three I think I mentioned that maybe I didn't but he just turned three on Easter so he just turned three but like I said, he's kind of the baby of the family. We just love him. And his nickname around here is Dennis the Menace because he's just hes just a little Dennis the Menace. He gets into trouble sometimes. Fun trouble. <laughs> and I also have my husband, Darren. We've been together for a little over 18 years, 18 and a half years. So we live in Eastern Central Florida, right by the coast. So it's a fun place to be. We live kind of close to like NASA. So when the space shuttles or the rockets launch, we can always feel the house shake, kind of cool. Random fact, just in case you guys are wondering. Um, so yeah, I'm just upstairs now. We're gonna pick up this bathroom, just again, super quick clean, pick up my room and just keep on cleaning. So this is the face powder from a compact I dropped on the floor. I had it like kind of piled off to the side in my bathroom to bring the vacuum up and clean it up. And my son went into the bathroom, stepped in it without realizing it and walked back out of my room. And so I came up and I had these like little white footprints leading out from my bathroom through my bedroom down the stairs. It was kind of funny. It looked like a crime scene or something. So anyways, I was just kind of getting a wipe and wiping those up and now we're going to pick up my collection of cups that I like to collect throughout the week that I always regret being too lazy to do anything with when I use them originally and we're just gonna pick up my nightstand too heavy on my own the world is moving on I'm still standing here Searching for steady ground A place to settle down No reasons left to find One day I'll change your mind And it won't come easy But I know it's worth the fight And I will run across the river So we are done upstairs. Like I said, it was just kind of a quick little clean. We are gonna go downstairs. I have a basket of laundry. This was, I think Tyler's. So I just put it at the bottom of the stairs for him to get. We're gonna pick up the living room, just, you know, get some stuff straightened out around here. And there's my supervisor, Charlie. Mentioned him earlier, just hanging out, seeing what I'm doing. Apparently it wasn't very entertaining, so he left. <laughs> and then he'll be back, I'm sure. So we're gonna get this couch straightened out and I just kind of shoved my computer stuff to the side because I'm gonna be sitting there and editing later anyways. Look who's back. He's back for some action. Nothing going on, Charlie. So we are just gonna, like I said, finish cleaning and straightening up the living room. Just a kind of quick clean. 
and then we're going to move I'm just kidding we're not we're still cleaning picking up some socks looks like a pair of underwear and trash and Charlie I think had those socks over in the corner he likes to steal socks and run off with them our little Dennis the Menace so I am just picking up some trash he had gotten into there's a toy I just picked up of his and I put it in his toy box there's another toy here's another toy <laughs> he's just oh, he's such a little rascal it's like having a toddler I swear that's what it brings me back to so I did like a quick pickup of the den we're gonna head into the dining room and just clean this off and I think I was getting on to Charlie because he was barking nobody was here though I looked to see if Amazon guy was here you never know with me I don't know this guy shows up all the time oh look here's Charlie's birthday he turned three on Easter I'll show you guys the pictures I think that we deserve a medal for getting his pain in the butt self to get a picture that was horrible Here's a few, <laughs> here's just a few photos I'll share with you. We tried doing like a kind of photo shoot with him. He was not having it. This was the only, I think we got two good shots. That was it. And then there was another one. He was not feeling the bunny ears, guys. He ran off with them. He did not enjoy it at all. And then he ate them. That's what he did. Happy Easter. Happy birthday, Charlie. All right, we're still in the dining room. We're just going to finish cleaning up in here. And then we're going to move to my disaster kitchen. No judgment. Yeah, it feels like you're the one who saves me. The one who saves me. I'm trying not to... All right, now we are moving into the kitchen, the disaster kitchen. Here's pizza from last night. Thermometer, because Tyler's sick right now my son I think he gave me a cold too dishes I did on Wednesday that are still there dirty dishes in the sink the holy guacamole tons of recycling and trash the supervisor doing absolutely nothing as always ceiling tile my daughter's a senior and I purchased this for her and she gets to like paint it and they like put it up in the ceiling so it's there for forever so she can leave her mark I'm really really excited about that and then here's just a clip of the carpet that Charlie's trying to lay currently. So we're gonna clean up the kitchen. It's a wreck. Let's do it. But it's all I have. You know, we could run to a place where we belong. But I need you there with me to go on. Sometimes I. to do need a sign from above I just want to be somebody who knows who knows how to behave but I'm not even close 
Won't you save, 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 save me? Won't you save, save? I always feel so much better when the island is like cleaned up. I think I've talked about this in other videos. It's kind of like when I clean it, it's like making the bed. It just makes everything else in the kitchen seem so much cleaner and it gets so dirty so quick. It's like the central hub of the house, the main, the main place, the happen in place. And the people love her. Wanna take that part of me and leave it in the dirt? Won't you save, 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 save me? Won't you save, 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 save me? Won't you save? For far too long now Wanna tear down the curtains Let the sun shine in Oh, I've been seeking forgiveness Cause I know I was wrong Oh, I'm running out of time I have to stay strong we're gonna quickly wash these dishes. I actually wish it was this fast in real life. It's not though. So I'm gonna wash these. Fun fact, I got my new dishwasher I talked about a few videos ago. I think we've used it like three times. Most of it was like tumblers and I just, I like to hand wash those. So I just went ahead and hand washed everything else. So here we've got this pile of trash and recycling that we are going to, I'm kind of going to sort and organize and then my son's going to take all the trash and recycling out. There's, hey, there's an Amazon box. Speaking of Amazon. Um, so yeah, we're going to just pick everything up, kind of get it organized a little bit so it's a little easier to carry out. And then we are going to, I think we're going to clean off the counters and then vacuum.
first time I ever saw you I fell in love when you entered the room And when the light hit your face We were just kids but I knew right away That I will be with you until I stop breathing I will keep loving you as long as my heart's beating Oh, hold me close Promise you won't let go I'm nothing without you I don't know what I would do without you All right, so we are now going to vacuum all of this dog fur up you know, I mentioned, I think in the last video that I believe Charlie is shedding his winter coat. It's never like been this bad, but I definitely think that he is for sure because I'm finding, sorry, that was him. All these like little tufts of hair everywhere. Like it's like stacking on each other. I don't know. It's weird, but anyways, he is definitely shedding. So I'm going to have to pick up my vacuum game guys because it's insane the amount of fur he is shedding. So we are just gonna finish vacuuming and here I had Tyler vacuum in the living room for me I tried not to give him too many chores on this day because like I said earlier he is like sick and has a fever so I just had him take out the trash and recycling and vacuum in the living room so I'm gonna finish vacuuming in the kitchen and then we are done so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope that it motivated you that's why I make this too give you guys you know motivation and just to help you feel like you have somebody there cleaning with you sometimes it helps to just kind of feel like you have a partner in crime or somebody to hang out with and talk to so I hope you enjoyed it I hope you enjoyed my company and Charlie's and if you did don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more videos I have lots more coming your way and I will see you guys in the next one She didn't love you back, love you back All she did was leave a hole in your chest You didn't get that job, get that job Even though you really gave it your best And now you're wondering what's the point What's the point of anything at all But let me tell you why, tell you why That's just life putting you through the test Before the dawn, it's always dark Before the light